that brings me to Sex, Love, and Pain to the tour. Performing. Performing. We know Tank loves to engage with the fans, engage with the ladies. Explain the performance and what that really does and how that validates an artist, not only from being able to be visually uh, performed in a music video, sounds good in the studio, but when you, the fans see the performance, explain the performance of, of what you do on stage, especially on this new tour, that validates an R&B artist. Well, I mean, the performance, you know, is the thing that takes your career from just a record and it maybe being a two-year run to, you know, in my case, you know, two or three records and 16 years. You know what I mean? A 16-year run so far. Because when you establish yourself as somebody who people will pay to see, not just pay to hear, you know what I mean? Somebody swiping the card at the house or, or turning on title or turning on, you know, their little Apple Music or whatever, that's different. But somebody actually getting dressed, getting their hair and nails done, grabbing a new outfit, you know what I'm saying, to come out and see you perform. The longevity in that um, is timeless and priceless. And I think that's what a lot of artists these days are missing. You know, I've, I've, I've gone to a bunch of shows where, you know, um, artists are performing their songs, but they're not entertaining the crowd. Like, there has to be a certain amount of entertainment value connected to your performance, um, visually, musically, um, all of the above. You know what I mean? So if if you're not doing that, then you're not just selling the audience short. You're selling yourself short because, you know, the the, the fans are very, um, are very picky about who they're going to spend their money on. You know what I mean? If if they're going to go to one or or two shows a month or maybe one show, you know what I'm saying, that month, you're competing against I don't know how many different artists, how many different radio shows, how many different independently promoted shows. And they have to make a decision that they're going to come see you. Why are they going to come see you versus go see anybody else? Because of their favorite song? Uh, Maybe. But if you have a track record of of, of coming into a city and turning that city out, Nine times out of ten, they're going to come see you, regardless of what their favorite song is. They want to be entertained. They want to forget about their bills. They want to forget about their boss yelling at them all day. They even might want to get away from their boyfriend or girlfriend for a few hours and just have a good time. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And, they're, and they're going to pick you because you are entertaining. You're not just standing up there singing songs. They can they can listen to the CD if they want that. But you are entertaining. That's that's the piece that we that we've got to get back. What is Tank going to do on this tour that is different from any other tour or show that he's done before? I'm not going to tell you. <laughs> I'm not going to tell you. <laughs> okay, can you give us this? I tell okay, you like give... this: we've. You just have to go look at the reviews, and I'll tell you right now: there's not one disappointed person in that room. There are people who came for one thing and they got that and then some. They had no idea that that was going to happen in that room. And Okay, and, so can I, let me ask you this, okay, are you doing something, at least answer me this, do, do this for do this for the people that's listening or going to uh, hear this interview. Are you going to do something different if every show is going to be the same and then people just have to Wait till they go see it to to experience it. You just have to see it to experience it, bro. I'll tell you like this. I'll give you this. I'll okay. give you this. I'm going to take you from the beginning all the way to now. Like I've never, you know, I, this is my first headline tour, so I hadn't had the chance to really tell my story musically. And so I'm finally going to be able to tell my story musically from start to finish. You know what I mean? And people are going to get that journey. And that's something that they've never been able to get from me um, on a tour before or on a show before because this is my first one. So here we go. 